Day three of the Canadians training camp saw another scrimmage with the Reds beating the Whites 3-1. to one. The best goal of the day was a backhander uh, by Barton Revi, a young man who has both Czech and Slovak citizenship. He beat Carey Price with a backhander. Revi has been playing with Gatton though in the Quebec Major Junior Hockey League. He'll probably end up there uh, for this coming season. But he's showing that he can play with the bigger guys. He's only five foot nine, but he doesn't seem to be intimidated by the bigger and faster NHL players he's coming up against. No, no, no. I, I think it's better for me. You know, uh, uh, you don't have to skate. Uh, you don't have to skate like in Europe and. Uh, 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 for me. Right. <laughs> it, it must have been good for you to learn English as well. Yeah, also, yeah. Uh, we learn English in uh, Slovakia or Czech uh, in the school, but uh, you know, when you came here, it's, it's different. It's, everyone speaks so fast. So. Christian Thomas has been getting a great opportunity in this camp with Brian Gianta uh, limited because of the uh, bicep surgery we had during the offseason. Thomas, uh, the son of former NHL star Steve Thomas, has been playing on a line with Thomas Placanitz and Rene Bork and says he's happy for the opportunity. Um, I think he was uh, a really gritty guy uh, when he played. Um, you know, he'd fight once in a while too. Uh, he tells me uh, getting guys' faces, uh, no matter how big or small they are, and you know, compete every time you're on the ice and uh, shoot the puck. For me, it was it's weird uh, having a dad that plays. Um, when you see um, the big stars, it's not as as wow as uh, you know another guy would see it. But um, you know, it was awesome. Uh, you know, seeing guys like Eisenman. Uh, Ryan White had a scare on Wednesday when he caught a stick from Lars Eller. It opened up a seven-stitch cut above his right eye, but he was back on the ice today, and he scored one of the goals for the Reds in their 3-1 win. So I was on early. sleeping through camp the first day, and uh, they wanted to wake me up a little bit. So, uh, <laughs> How many zippers? Uh, seven. Seven? seven. Seven, yeah. Doc did a good job. It was, uh, it was leaking pretty good, and uh, you know, they did a good job. Took care of me. I was a little bit worried there at first, and what really happened, and blood squirting everywhere was a little bit uh, <laughs> a little bit too much for me, but uh, like I said, they did a really good job, calmed me down, and took care of me, and I uh, feel good today. One player with uh, some NHL credentials is Nick Tarnaski. He's a big tough guy and uh, he felt that his best opportunity for landing a job back in the NHL was to play with the Canadians because they're looking for size and a little bit of physical play. He's the kind of guy who can supply it. 